The benefit-cost ratio can support a decision-making scenario by employing a mathematical equation that results in a quantitative estimate. We use this estimate, like an informal crystal ball, to scope out the benefits of a particular situation against the costs of the situation. As you can see, it is a ratio, benefit divided by cost. It looks like this. The benefit is the estimated sales that would be made in this particular project multiplied by the probability that we will succeed in hitting that number. The cost is the estimated costs times by the probability of achieving the cost target. When we actually run the ratio, it looks like this. We assume that we have made the decision to work on a project that we project will generate $50,000 worth of revenue. And we're going to say that our assurance that we can hit that projected amount or the probability is 85%. We run the top portion of this equation by multiplying $50,000 by 0.85 and the expected revenue is $42,500. Now let's go to the estimated cost. We calculate that this will be $6,000 worth of costs to create the project and the probability that we can keep the budget at that amount is at 90% certainty. When we run this part of the equation, we see the expected value of costs is $5,400. Now, when we divide the expected value of the revenue, $42,500, by the expected value of the cost, $5,400, the resulting benefit-cost ratio is 7.87 which means that for every dollar that we spend on this project or this idea, we estimate that we'll earn $7.87. That's a terrific return. The BC ratio is a quantitative estimate that helps us quickly see if our decision was sound or if our decision was folly. You'll quickly realize that the BC analysis is based on estimation. And estimation is, of course, only as reliable as the data and the sources that spawn the hypothesized numbers. Use the BC analysis as a back-of-envelope informal means of checking out a decision's wisdom.